Hi, my name is Ryan Guy, and in this short video tutorial, I'm going to show you the process to record a speech on YouTube, upload it, and send it to your instructor. So let's go ahead and get started. The first thing that you want to do is open your browser and navigate to YouTube.com. Once you're on the YouTube site, you want to go ahead and sign in with your YouTube account. If you don't have an account, you can click Create an Account and go through the simple process to go ahead and create one. But for the sake of this example, let's go ahead and assume that you already have a YouTube account. Once you're signed in, you want to go ahead and click on the upload link located at the top of the YouTube page. And that's going to bring you to this screen. There are a few different options on here, but what you're looking for is the record from webcam option. Go ahead and click on this. This will bring you into the record from webcam platform, and it's going to prompt you with a little flash message asking for, for permission to use your webcam. Go ahead and click the allow button and then close that dialog box. It'll take just a second for your webcam to come online and then you're ready to go ahead and record your presentation. So get yourself ready and when you're ready go ahead and click record and it'll start recording. Give your speech or presentation at this point. When you're done with your presentation go ahead and click the little red um, square which will stop the presentation. YouTube will then take a second to go ahead and generate a preview of the speech or presentation that you just gave. I recommend that you watch that speech or presentation and make sure it is the best possible product that you can create. One of the nice things about giving a presentation on a computer mediated platform such as YouTube is you have the ability to make sure the finished product is the best possible product that you can create. So you can go ahead and watch that preview button take a look at that speech and make sure it's what you really want to turn in. At that point, if you're happy with it, go ahead and click the publish button and that's going to take you to this next screen that's got a couple of useful options that I want to go over. So when the screen comes up, first thing that you want to do is go ahead and give the speech a useful title. Uh, probably something related to the activity or assignment for which you're creating the speech or presentation. And then the description, it's a good idea to go ahead and list the course or um, class for which you're creating the speech. The last thing that you need to do is cruise on down to the privacy box and you'll see that there's a few different options on here, public, unlisted, and private. For recording a speech and sending it out to an instructor, the option that you want is unlisted. Go ahead and check that radio box. The reason for this is that you probably don't want everybody in the world to be able to view your speech, um, just the person to which you're sending it to. So go ahead and click on that and then click down here on the link and copy that link to the clipboard. You'll notice that there is this private option. I have experimented around a little bit with the private option, but find that it just creates more problems than it's worth and tends to lead to the instructor not being able to view the speech or presentation. So go ahead and choose unlisted, copy that, and then click save. At this point, your speech is now published to the web. You can take that link uh, paste it onto an email and send it to your instructor and then they'll be able to view and watch that presentation uh, online. I hope this video presentation has been useful. If you have any questions, please contact me. Thank you.